guys, what's up and welcome back to the Daily Yeet. This week is story time. Well, it's, it's not story time week. It's freestyle week, but I'm going to be doing a story time because I have been wanting to tell a story for such a long time and I finally get to do it. I'm literally... I'm so excited. I This is one of my favorite story times and this was one of the best nights of my life so I'm super excited to share with all of you beautiful people what happened on the night of December 13th of 2017. So without further ado, let's just get into this video. Okay, so I met Sean December 13th of 2017 and it was so amazing. I'll, I guess I'll start from the beginning. Where else would you start? I was the last to get ready, but we went down. We probably waited in line for about six or seven hours. Um, if I believe that's correct. I actually think it was like maybe five or six because I remember it was shorter than the amount of time that I waited for the Jack and Jack meet and greet. So it was probably five or six hours that I waited in line. Um, I was so excited. Literally, it took two more hours for even like two other people to show up. And like this glob of a line formed and I, I was at the beginning of it <laughs> and I was so nervous like I literally was probably almost gonna pee myself I was just I was not okay and my mom checked it and everything we got our tickets checked and then we get these we get these schnazzy lanyards that are so cute. Oh, this is when everything was setting in for me. Like, when we got these, I was like... Like, it's happening, guys. Like, I literally waited eight months for this to happen. And it... Well, more than eight months, but that's when I got the tickets. So, technically eight months when I knew it was gonna happen. Um... Oh my goodness! Like, I... I was freaking out. And... So... Then we go down, we went down this escalator and we like followed somebody somewhere. I don't know. We went, and I think we lined up by a security guard and when there was enough people to take, they took us to like line up on this wall about to walk into this room and I was not okay. I was so nervous and like we had gotten these lanyards and I didn't really want it in my picture. So I, I believe I put it in my back pocket, but if I didn't, then I probably still wore it. I'm not sure. Um, so they like told us the deal and then they were like, okay, put your stuff down on the table and then like put everything down on the table put your phones on the table you're not allowed to take selfies with him obviously so um then i put everything down on the table and i like i was gonna i was thinking for a second about like voice like voice recording but i'm so glad i didn't because i definitely don't want my i don't want to hear my voice because i will tell you guys in a second it was so embarrassing okay so then we like followed this like tape line to like this black box of like curtains and like Oh my god, I was so nervous. I, I remember like um, someone pulling the curtain. I didn't pay attention to anything if I'm being quite honest. Like I just remember the, pulling the curtain and I see Sean in all his glory and I'm like Can we take a second? <laughs> like can I take a second? But um, no one had a second so I had to go. And so I was the first person to meet, in Hon meet him in Hong Kong and Oh, our conversation was so bad. Like, I was literally, I literally looked at him, and I was like, hi. Literally, no, 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 I, I'm not kidding. It did that, like, my vocal cords shook. I thought that, like, I didn't know what to do, so I said hi, but my vocal cords were shaking. I was shaking. So, it just came out, like, vibrant. It was so so embarrassing like that was disgusting and my friend like doesn't tease me about it but she's like no that was so cute remember when you like said hi to sean and that's that, that was like so cute and i was oh, it was so ugly and like i don't know i was so embarrassed about that and he was like hi honey and then we hugged and um we took a picture everyone always asks me like the basic the basic questions these questions are weird if you're not a fangirl but if you're a fangirl you know these questions like what does he smell like is he like what he is in his like videos um how tall is he um i don't know just like expectations versus reality i guess basically and i like i couldn't answer their questions because i was like 
I don't know what he smells like. Um, I barely looked at his face because I was so nervous. Uh, the, the like most I looked at his face was during the concert and <sighs> we'll get there in a second, but the concert was so good. Anyways, so I met him and um, we were about to take a picture and I was like, wait, can you hold my hand for the photo? And he was like, yeah, of course. And so we held hands and we took the picture and I was smiling and he was smiling and it was cute. So we hugged and I was like, thank you so much, um, bye, I love you so much. Or I said, I, I don't know if I said I love you, I just said bye, thank you. And he was like, thank you so much honey, bye, Have a, like enjoy the show. And so I was like, oh thank you, like bye. And so I like walked out and like literally, I for like literally 10 seconds, I probably just stood there. Like... I mean, it was probably not 10, it was probably like 4 or 5, but I just stood there and I like looked off into space and I was like, I like literally just met him, like what the heck, but it wasn't that good of like, it wasn't that good of a meet and greet, it was literally 5 seconds and the only reason it was 5 seconds was because I asked to hold his hand, if I didn't ask to hold his hand, it probably would have been 3, so the meet and greet was kind of crappy, but I, I literally thought the meet and greet was, I was kind of disappointed, like, with the meet and greet when I got out. I was like, okay. So, then you get a poster, a signed poster. I'll, uh, I don't want to, like, take it down and bring it over here. So, I'll just, gonna, I'm just going to insert, like, a picture of the poster. I think I was more excited about the poster than I was about meeting him, to be totally honest, because it's just, like, the meet and greet flew by so far, but it was so good. It ended up being so, like, good, because... I was the first person to meet him, which meant, like, I got to choose the first seat. If you didn't know, there's a meet and greet and then there's a Q&A. So, um, if you have not been in a meet and greet, like, not a meet and greet, but, like, a Q&A with Sean, um, there's basically just a table, like, a foldable table with, like, a drape over it and then, like, a background. It's just, like, good vibes all around, honestly. It's so cool. And then he kind of like he kind of just sits on the table like there's literally not even a chair it's just a table he just sits on the table there's like tape around the table to show you where to sit and where not to sit so i literally since i was the first one to meet him i sat literally right in the middle i was like i plopped myself down i was like i'm literally gonna look up at sean mendes for 15 minutes straight and i was so excited with that so we sat down we waited for the meet and greet to be over i just kept on looking at ashley and i was like oh my goodness so i didn't know when i was gonna get the pictures because they released them on the website but i couldn't get into the website with my account um so i was really really confused on how i was gonna get them so finally like literally the next day i finally got my pictures they got it from twitter i didn't even get it from the website i got it from twitter i just love that for me i don't I don't know um but yeah anyways we're waiting for Sean to come out and he does come out he explains like the like, all the rules of like the meet and greet and everything like that so then um <laughs> so everyone's asking him questions and like I was I had a question for him too so I rose I raised my hand but I didn't know if he was gonna pick me because I'm like right in the middle of him so like why would, like, usually people don't pick people that are, like, right in the middle. Like, they'll pick someone else. But he did pick me for a question. Okay, mind you, I will show you this video. Actually, you know what? I won't show you this video. Just because it's so embarrassing. I was stuttering and I just froze. Like, I couldn't talk. So, I will not show you the video, but I will tell you what I said. I said, um, if you could go back to your, like, 2013 self and give yourself like a piece of advice for like what you've been through so far what would it be and he said nothing because that's cheating so yeah that was his answer but like that was not even okay so that was a good part of the meet and greet he like talked to me smiled at me looked at me like whatever like that was cute but the best part of the meet and greet i will show you this video he asked us a quick question he was like okay quick question is like hong kong in china and we were all like, I said no, and some people said yes, but I was like, no, it's like, it's different. I kept on saying it's different, it's different. And, oh, it's like, literally, I hate my voice. I was like, no, it's different, it's different, it's different. And like, he said something. There's one, this one girl was like, it's complicated, but I don't think he heard her. And then, like, I was like agreeing with her. I was like, yeah, and I was like, it's complicated. But the next thing I know, he's like, it's complicated, yeah, on Facebook it would be like, it's a complicated relationship. And he looked down at me when he said it, and I was like... Ah! Like, I, okay, whoa. 
the people below me are not going to be too happy. But I was freaking out. Okay, a question, actually serious question. Is Hong Kong inside of China yes. or... Yes. Yes. It's separated. Yes. It's so different. To Hong Kong. It's different. Yeah. So okay, many, so you're asking? Yeah. It's complicated. So you all said different things, by the way. Because <laughs> it's complicated. It's complicated, yeah. On Facebook, it would be like, it's complicated relationship. <laughs> I wish you could see my face after he said that to me, because I literally turned to Ashley, and I was like... Like, I was shaking, and I was about to cry. I was like, he looked at me. Like, he noticed me when I said something to him. I don't even know why. I just, like... It wasn't that big of a deal, but like I, to me it was. I I I don't know, but that that's what happened in the Q and A. Okay, guys, so I'm gonna have to cut the video off here because it's getting a little bit long, but it was an amazing concert. Um, I'll insert some videos of the concert at the end of the video after the outro. But yeah, I'll insert some of those there, and I hope you enjoyed this video, even though this is not the outro, I just figured I'd say hi and pop in in the middle of the video while I'm editing, if you want to see. Yeah, that's me editing. <sighs> that's, that's, that's my story time. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you did not, still give it a thumbs up, because Shawn Mendes rules. Um, that sounded weird. But anyways... Thank you guys all so much for watching. Please subscribe. <laughs> um, and be sure to watch all of our other videos. Um, go to our profile and then watch our videos. Because they're pretty cool. They're pretty awesome. I suck at doing videos. So you don't have to watch me. But you can watch anyone else. They're all super talented. And we're having a lot of fun on this channel recently. So subscribe. Like, comment down below if you did like this. What your favorite part was. And yeah, I'll see you guys next week with another video. <laughs> um, ew. I hope you have a beautiful day and week and month and year and life. Bye, guys.